Hey YouTube, welcome back. How is everybody doing? Before we get into it, I just wanted to say thank you all so much for being so understanding about missing an episode last week. Life got a little hectic. Honestly, a lot of you are probably just used to me not even having a schedule. You know, the OGs. Season one and two is a time. Anyway, I just wanted to say thank you, but let's we'll, we'll roll through the things so that we can get on with it. So first things first, make sure you are subscribed and then hit the little bell because it helps to know whenever I upload here. If full length reactions are your thing, you can find those on my Patreon link down below, along with a link to my main channel where I'm watching all of the Scream movies and also all of the Twilight movies. So I just feel like it's a good time to get over there. And last but certainly not least, leave a comment down below, but no spoilers. Okay. Oh my god. Double header today. For me, anyway. There was some it's apparently this isn't technically a two parter, but so like but I don't care. <laughs> Whatever the technicality is, I don't care. Okay. Treating it as one. But I've got coffee and I'm ready to go. But I guess before we get into it, I'm like I I've been trying to think like what is gonna be about. I don't really think I know, obviously. But the only thing I can think of is maybe the mayor will come back into play here. Like maybe we'll revisit that storyline like I kind of wanted to last time. But maybe not. I It could be something to do with like Buffy and Angel. It could be something to do with like Faith. It could be something to do with like like Roop. Like it, the Watcher stuff that we ignored last episode pretty much. So it really could be anything. But I guess if I had to place my best guess, it would be that maybe it would be surrounding the mayor we gotta figure out what he is man we gotta figure out his deal you guys already know <laughs> so uh, i mean me i have to figure out what he is okay and like other than that i have nothing else to say before we hop right into it i guess i'm kind of been like thinking i wonder how i'll feel about xander this episode because i was so like protective of him last episode like i was like oh man our boy xander you know he's going through it and uh so i wonder if today that will stay or if we'll go back to like, you know, me just constantly being annoyed by him. Little bro kind of stuff. Other than that, no thoughts. I, I'm just excited. So I'm just, whatever. I'm good. I'm done talking. This coffee is already getting a little cold though. Do I heat it up now? Should I go heat it up? No. So what, you're telling me never? Fake! Really, now is not the time! Come on, really. All this time and not even once. <laughs> What do you want to what? Say it! I have never done it! With Xander! <laughs> He's just a friend. I love Xander, I just don't love Xander. Yeah. Why are those vampires wearing, like, uniforms? Looked like uniforms. Okay, count of three. One. <laughs> three. <laughs> Sword? Sick. <laughs> oh, nice. Nicely diverted, V. That was cool. That was cool. <laughs> Nicely diverted, V. Check these out. <laughs> I was expecting roof. And I like looked up from the sword. So like, fuck, that was so weird. Oh my god, kind of threw me off a bit there for a second. <laughs> okay, well, hey, we're there. He is. Where's the owner of these fine implements? Common term is slain. He's always on the furniture, unsanitary. Nobody can tell Marmaduke what to do. That's my kind of dog. <laughs> I like to read Kathy. <laughs> the dedication is the final step before my ascension. I have waited longer than you can imagine for this. <laughs> Me too, ma'am. Let's just see that that information reaches the Slayers. Who knows? With any luck, they'll kill each other. Then everyone's a winner. <laughs> Everyone, of course, being me. <laughs> his ascension. I just love the little, like, characteristic of his, where he's kind of like a clean freak. I, I, it makes me like him a lot. I don't know why. I might have my own tendencies. I re, do I relate to the mayor? I, I, I got in to actual colleges and, and they're wooing me. They're pitching woo. The wooing stage is always fun. 
Like right now, I'm torn between the fast-growing fields of appliance repair and motel management. Of course, I'm still waiting to hear <laughs> back from the uh, corn dog and poor him, so. That's so cute. Planning life as a loser? Most people just turn out that way, but you're really taking charge. Okay, we're back to normal. <laughs> so, life beyond high school. Anyone, please, chime in. I just, like, how come... <laughs> What's going to go down with Miss Cordelia? Because they're purposefully keeping her relevant, but it, like it feels almost unnecessary to just have her and Xander constantly going back and forth. Like last episode, it was like, okay, I, I get it. Cause that was like the whole, I was setting us up. By us, I mean me up to feel sorry for Xander and like, but are we just going to keep doing this? It feels different. Like before she was a part of the group, it was funny because it was like, oh, like she's just, but she's been a part of like our friend group and like been there with us through some really intense times. And now just having her back and like constantly going after Xander feels different now. It feels a little weird. So I feel think or feel like maybe they're trying to keep her relevant for a future storyline but I wish it would come faster because I don't want to like dislike her but if it's like this constant unnecessary you know I might start to dislike her nah probably not but do you know what I mean <laughs> he's looked better of course training procedures have been updated quite a bit since your day much greater emphasis on field work really oh yes I have, in fact, faced two vampires myself. Under controlled circumstances, of course. Yeah, no danger. Does every watcher have an accent? <laughs> Am I going to have to go through the whole, like, do I trust this accent thing with this guy? I don't trust him. I might trust him, but I don't like him already. Okay, I'm just going to declare that before even knowing anything about him. Because I'm team Rube. And if Rube is sad, I'm sad. So, okay? I don't like this guy. But I might trust him a little bit because he's a watcher. So, like, fair enough, you know? But that one watcher woman, she was a little trickster. Oh, man. Vampires? Controlled circumstances. Hello, Buffy. Aww. Hello. <laughs> he's kind of cute. No. New watcher? New watcher. Wesley Wyndham Price. Is he evil? Steve evil? Fine. The last one was evil. So oh, yes. Two. Gwendolyn Post. We all heard. <laughs> No, oh, Mr. Giles has checked my credentials rather thoroughly. Ha <laughs> I did the background check. Vampires. Yes? Killed him. Anything else you can tell me? <laughs> uh, one of them had swords. I, I don't think he was with the other two. One long, one short? Mm, both pointy, with, like, jewels and things. Yeah. Sounds familiar. It should. Who brought them to the new world, specifically here? seem to know a lot about them. I didn't get this job because of my looks. I really, really believe that. I've researched <laughs> this town's history. When he was killed, it was taken by a wealthy landowner named... I don't want to bore you with the details. Bore me with the details. Are you not used to being given orders? No. Whenever Giles sends me on a mission, he always says, please. And afterwards, I get a cookie. <laughs> ah, this is perhaps faith. Yeah, if you think Buffy's tough. New Watcher? <laughs> New Watcher. <laughs> Screw that. That's what I'm saying. Uh, don't say anything incredibly interesting while I'm gone. <laughs> don't get used to me. No, I won't. Is he gonna die? Because, <laughs> like, they can't do the, like, evil Watcher thing again. So, like, is he gonna die? How are we gonna get Root back as our Watcher? I feel like some sort of petition needs to be filed. We're Slayer's girlfriend, the Chosen Two. Why should we right. let him take all the fun out of it? Yeah, <laughs> go rogue. Look in your eyes right after a kill. Just get hungry for more. You're way off base. Hey, slang's what we were built for. If you're not enjoying it, you're doing something wrong. <sighs> what about the assignment? Tell you what, you do the homework and I'll copy yours. <laughs> Game over. Oh. There's a lot of them. They're fancy little uniforms. 
into one somewhere. Oh. Faith. Faith. What are you doing, hiding in there? <laughs> Looking for the amulet. Who said I had a plan? I don't know how many's down there, but I want to find out. And I'll know when I land. If you don't come in after me, I might die. Oh, no. Oh, she has to go. Not great. Not good decision. Slayer is willful and insolent. That would be our girl, wouldn't it? We have to get to know her. Her abuse of the English language is such that I understand only every other sentence. <laughs> this is going to make fascinating reading. Aww. She'll be back by now. Yeah. We're surrounded! You notice that too? <laughs> then let's just settle it. Come on, V. I hate it when they drown me. Oh, fuck. I was like, are we doing this again? Are we fucking doing this again? We came for the amulet. Tell me you don't get off on this. Didn't suck. <laughs> Faith is like, she's going a little rogue. <laughs> she's like enjoying this. I don't want to say too much because to each their own. Whatever. But it's interesting. She's definitely got a bit of a different perspective on this whole slang thing. I don't think that's going to go well with the new watcher. Maybe she just won't have a watcher. Maybe she'll be like a lone slayer, you know? Remember the three key words for any slayer. Preparation, preparation, preparation. That's, That's one, one word, word three times. <laughs> the only thing you need to discuss with Mr. Giles is overdue book fees. Understood? We'll talk. Of course. <laughs> You're on the honor system. So remember, no talking. See, the thing was, Faith knew that I didn't even want to go down there. <clears throat> Periodic tables on the wall. Didn't really have to put it in the back of the book. Sorry. She's gonna get so kicked out. In the sewers. And Faith's got three of them on her at once. Hey, whoa. Can we resume Buffy's ode to Faith later, like when I'm not actively multiple choicing? How come your eye twitches every time I say Faith's name? <laughs> Faith. <laughs> Cut it out. I'm gonna test today, okay? And I'm highly caffeinated, and I'm trying to concentrate. <laughs> no, she, she can't. Can't she? She's gonna go out the window. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> uh, found a nest. That's potential. Ooh. Uh -oh. It's your wake up call. Oh my god, I love them. <laughs> Gotta my eyes. Hey! You're not leaving, are you? Uh, I saw you making friends. From what I'm hearing, that's not something we'd like to see happen. No problem, we got the amulet. I know, I spoke to Giles, but he said you gave it to ah, someone. Who are you are? Ah, speak of the really annoying person. Who are you? A friend. Do you have it? It's somewhere safe. <laughs> How did you know? Pooch is your jacket. Balthazar is dead. Am I the only one that remembers that? Be careful. <laughs> Everyone's just ignoring you. How did Angel get frosted tips? Or is that just lighting? Let me tell you what I see. I see fear. The pitiful look of faces that cry out for mercy. But what I... Is that a brain? I'm gonna be honest, I don't love that part. Uh... I don't see is what I want to see. We had it, but the slayer already on board. 
That's the grossest thing that this um, show has ever had. No alarm is going on. Shard. Strangely, it's not my priority. When are you gonna get this, B? Take half. Me picking. I'm getting it. <laughs> A little rebellious, puppy. Drop the weapons and get down on the ground. My ass is robbery. <laughs> Slow. He's butch. <laughs> uh oh. That's some artillery. We're going to jail. At some point, they're going to have to do a fucking jail plot because I feel like <laughs> I've been teased with it. A few times now. So sometime it's just going to have to happen. Maybe today's the day. Although I feel like not with Faith. She's 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 going to break out somehow. Just like push the screen or something. I don't know. Do you want to get out of here? Yeah. It's a plant. Oh, she's just going to... Can't, can't save the world in jail. <laughs> I know. I mean, even though they're out now, they're gonna be in trouble, right? Come on! Uh-oh. 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 So what'd you and Faith do last night? <laughs> Nothing. Not much. Yeah. Let's see what's happening in Sunnydale. I could just eat them up. <laughs> so, any news about the Illuminati? <laughs> Name of Lord Balthazar. Die. You know, it's curious how he could have gotten all the way into my liquor cabinet. Alan, don't we have don't we have security working in this building? Poor Alan, man. He's I don't know if he's in the right profession. Bring the watchers to me. Find the slayers and kill them. Kill everything that gets in your way. Go. Oh man, he grosses me out. Just a little something we witches like to call a protection spell. Good deal. Protection. I love I'm this. surprised, though, because usually spell stuff's smart. Stinky. Yeah, that's why I added lavender. Give me time, and I may be the first Wicca to do all my conjuring in pine fresh scent. So what? I hate the smell of lavender. <laughs> it was very kind of her. I hate it. I know lavender's supposed to be pretty and calming and has all these wonderful things and it instantly gives me a headache as soon as i smell a tiny little bit of it i have a headache and if like if it's like the oil of it i will throw up it makes me gag i wish i could like it why is it just lavender does, any, does anyone else have that because when i tell you everyone loves lavender everywhere i've ever fucking gone people have lavender shit and people buy me lavender stuff because they know i like candles and they'll always buy me lavender candles and i'm always like oh, thank you i would rather it be stinky just leave it all stinky but I, i've done this sort of thing before like a million times and i can totally handle myself besides minty fresh protection so now mint good smell Stupid. Dying to test out the longbow. I think it might be my new thing. I can't believe you went back for that stuff. You know, after we're done. I didn't say you had emotional problems. My attachment to the Slayer is not a problem. In point of fact, it's been a very you handled this assignment is something of an embarrassment to the council. If you want to criticize my methods, fine. But you can keep your snide remarks to yourself. And while you're at <laughs> it, don't criticize my methods. It's simply time for somebody else to take the field. I don't like him. That's a good time to start. I didn't know. 
I didn't know. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Call 911. I, I need something to stop the. <laughs> That's not good. Obviously. <laughs> she didn't know. Like, fair enough. But, like, also, you know, I, you, you gotta be careful. I can't go around killing people. Does that mean she can't be a Slayer anymore? What happens when a Slayer kills a person? We almost found out one time with old Teddy Boy. But then he was, he was like a robot. No, I mean, that's gotta happen eventually, right? Like, humans getting, if they, especially if they're, like, working alongside vampires. Like, we should go ask Roop. <laughs> Just ask Roop what we should do. Let's go. Come on, we gotta go! It's one way to do it, I guess. Just... No. Go tell Roop. Hey, your hand. It's okay. Uh, I just went to the warehouse. I was waiting for you. I got Giles. He's like, mm, a little like, I'm just gonna... <clears throat> Voice in the front. Yeah, you kind of have been just sticking to that top right shoulder. <clears throat> oh, God. Doesn't seem too promising, does it? Stay calm, Mr. Charles. We have to stay <laughs> calm. Oh, my God, you're here. I was planning to panic. That would be your demon, you know, the dead one. <laughs> no need to get snippy. <laughs> I disagree. It's a perfect time to get snippy. If it's for me to scrub those hard to reach areas, I'd like to request you kill me now. <laughs> Ow. A trade intriguing. No, wait, boring. Pull off his kneecaps! No, 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 no! <laughs> this can tell you everything. Be quiet, you twerp. Yeah, what but, the fuck? But I'd like to have my kneecaps. Let Captain Courageous here go, and I'll tell you what you need to know. How's that deal? There is one deal! What is his name? His name is Angel. <laughs> Okay, hey, I was not expecting that. You can really see the double in that shot. Oh, it threw me off. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Okay. I just hate when it like, when it's noticeable, it's too noticeable and it like takes you out of the moment. That's okay. I'm still in it. I'm still in the moment. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Is it happening? Is it happening? I don't understand why Alan would miss this. He's usually so punctual. Because <laughs> he, he's Did it work? Away. Let's find out. Open the cage. Uh -oh. Sure. Okay, now we're ready. Okay. Good one. I'm gonna go this. Well. <laughs> Wait, what else was on that list? Nothing can harm me. 
haircut. <laughs> it's just weird. Nothing can harm me until the ascension. <laughs> Gosh, I'm feeling chipper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I bet. Who's for a root beer? How you doing? I'm all right. You know me. Hey, please don't shut me out here. Like, sooner or later, we're both gonna have to deal. Wrong. We can help each other. I don't need it. There is no body. I took it, weighted it, and dumped it. Body doesn't exist. Getting rid of the evidence doesn't make the problem go away. That was kind of smart. <clears throat> no, but bad. That was bad. Bad. You killed a man. No, you don't get it. I don't care. Hmm. Grr, arg. I don't know, y'all. Where are we going with this here? I kind of thought like maybe Faith would pull back a little and be like, oh fuck, I went too far and not good. I don't know. It's just like, I guess just pull it back a little. She's almost double. She fucking is. She dumped the body. She's almost doubling down. So it's like she's got this perspective of whatever it takes. Like she was just doing her job. Guy got in the way. Guy came out of nowhere. Had no way to distinguish. She's just kind of like, it is what it is. Interesting. God, it's so weird because it's like, like, is she fully rebelling against being a slayer? No, because she enjoys it. But does she enjoy being a slayer or does she just enjoy <laughs> offing things, creatures? I don't know. This is cool, though, because wow, like night and day. But what's Buffy going to do? Because Buffy's going to have to say something. I think she should talk to Roop. That's just my suggestion for everyone. Whenever you're in trouble, call Roop. He will help you. <laughs> Or try. It kind of sucks because I, I was hoping that like we would see more bonding with them. And like we kind of did at the beginning, but it was almost like Faith pulling, pulling Buffy into like the wild side, you know? So I was hoping I would like see them become quite close and like see a lot more bonding and stuff. But I'm feeling like the opposite's going to happen. I'm feeling like we're setting up the fucking opposite. Like Faith is just going to go, oh, it could be fun. <laughs> But I was just hoping for someone for Buffy because I just, I'm always hoping for someone for Buffy to just like have, and a Slayer's perfect because she, they, they get each other. Because I know she has Willow and Angel and like all the shit. That's not what I mean. Okay. And, and, and Mr. Mayor is, uh, invincible until his ascension. <laughs> It just gives me massive Halloween Town vibes and I I'm, I'm, love it. You can have some fun if you're invincible like that. He can't even get chopped up. He could go on like a little tear, you know, him and Trick. He <laughs> just go have some fun. Also, are we gonna are we gonna tell the group? Like, is Faith gonna tell the group about like her and Xander? Are like her and Xander are maybe gonna date? No. Faith isn't the dating kind. Which is great. I don't know. But the new watcher guy, wait, how long does he stay? How long is he here for? Because he's stressing me out. What do I think is gonna happen in part two? Should I do any type of guessing now no no i'm gonna save that for the beginning of the next video because a i have to pee so bad and b i then i need more coffee <laughs> and i might have a cookie so i guess i will wrap this one up here and i'll see you all in the next one